What we found here is a partial skeleton of a woolly mammoth. It was an adult male, probably in its 40s at the time of its death, probably lived between 10,000 and 15,000 years ago. It's not all of the animal. In fact, it's the skull, the jaw, the tusks, many of the vertebrae, not all of them, many of the ribs, not all of them, some of the pelvis, part of one shoulder blade, actually part of the other shoulder blade too, one kneecap. Our working hypothesis for what we're dealing with here is a partial skeleton, the pieces having been brought to this place by ancient humans for storage of carcass parts in a pond. It was their intent to come back later and retrieve this when they needed fresh meat. An animal doesn't just come apart naturally, leaving a sequence of tightly articulated vertebrae like that. We have evidence for human activity. We found three large boulders next to one another in one place just offset from the skull. And we've seen those before. We think that they are a kind of anchor. Being able to demonstrate the humans were here, and especially if it turns out they were here well back in time, those will be things that work to make this more and more important.